You know, many people say, how long do you pray? They tell me stories of somebody who prayed for four hours or five hours. And I say, you want me to know, tell you how long I pray? Please turn to Luke chapter 18. I'll tell you exactly how many hours I pray. I obey God who has told me in Luke 18 verse 1. We must pray all the time. 24 hours. And must not faint. So what does it mean to pray 24 hours? Obviously not being on our knees 24 hours because Jesus was not on his knees. He worked as a carpenter for so many hours. His prayer, like I told you earlier, he wakens my ear, and while I'm doing my other work, my ear is open to hear what the Lord is saying. It's a wonderful habit. When you get up in the morning, you hear something and you respond to it, and then throughout the day, say, Lord, my ear is open. One of the best pictures I have seen is uh, in some countries they have these policemen who drive cars and go around immediately to react to some situation where there's a problem. And they have a walkie-talkie in their car, connected to their headquarters. And it is on all the time. Because any time the message may come to this off police, policeman who's in this car. Sometimes it may be to another policeman in the car, but the, this this set must be open, must be kept open all the time, and they'll call one particular policeman, and that man responds to it. Or sometimes it may come to you. Sometimes the whole day, this man is not called at all because the problems are in other parts of the country of the city. But his his walkie-talkie or not walkie-talkie, that transmitting radio must be there, open all the time, and that has been my example. I must have a year that's always open to the Lord. Is the Lord saying to me all the time? I'm not list. I'm doing many other things, but with a heart that is open to listen. I'm trying to encourage everybody here to live by the highest standard of the Christian life. What I'm telling you is the highest standard of the Christian life, and every one of you can live by that. I wish somebody had told me this when I was 19 years old when I got converted, but I had to learn it myself. So what does it say? Men ought always to pray. That means 24 hours. You wanted to know how many hours I pray? Here it is. 24 hours a day. Not on my knees, but with the heart that's opening. Because I believe when it's just Jesus went into the wilderness to pray. I remember telling the Lord, I said, there's no wilderness in Bangalore. Which is the nearest wilderness? Have you found any wilderness near your place? <laughs> I lived here for 50 years. I never found a wilderness. And the Lord said, your early morning bed, your bed can be a wilderness. What did Jesus go to the wilderness to do? He wanted to be quiet, to listen. What is my father saying to me? And every one of us can do that every day. When you get up, either while lying down or sit in your bed and say, Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus, speak to me. Please let me hear. God is a God who speaks.